Elon Musk established SpaceX under the reality that a future where humanity is out exploring the stars is fundamentally more exciting than one where we are not. The company was established in 2002 with the main goal of bringing human life on Mars. Musk sees a future where humans live in a space civilization, regular voyages from Earth to Mars, and vice versa. To arrive at that goal, SpaceX has buckled down through good and bad times and creating the technology expected to get us there. And here are the top 10 SpaceX most memorable achievements thus far. Number 10. First Successful Flight of Falcon 1 After three tragic failures, the Private Space Flights Association's Falcon 1 rocket effectively blasted into space to break the record of the first privately constructed liquid-powered booster to reach orbit. The two-stage Falcon 1 rocket developed by Space Exploration Technologies lifted off at about 7.15 p.m. Eastern Time from the U.S. Army's Ronald Reagan Ballistic Defense Test Site, Kwajalein Atoll. The completed space shot came exactly a month after an engine timing mistake during stage separation that destroyed SpaceX's third Falcon 1 test. Nonetheless, SpaceX finally managed to make Falcon 1 a successful launch despite their troubles with the previous launches. Number 9. The Dragon Returns to Earth Unmanned Spacecraft Astronauts of the Dragon detached the cargo capsule from the station in the morning with a 58-foot robot arm aboard the orbiting lab. A sequence of rocket firings lowered the capsule's orbit from 230 miles high, allowing it to reappear into the atmosphere and parachute to water landing at more than 560 miles southwest of Los Angeles. After several months of stalling before its launch, the spacecraft conveyed about 1,000 pounds of food and hardware to the space station on the mission and got back with 1,455 pounds of conducted experiments and other supplies. The flawless cargo shipment and arrival were the first of 12 missions planned for the spacecraft as a part of a $1.6 billion agreement between SpaceX of Hawthorne, California and NASA. From the time being, the Dragon is the main cargo capsule capable of returning supplies to Earth from the space station not similar to the Russian, European, and Japanese ones that got destroyed upon re-entering the atmosphere. Basically, the Dragon is the only unmanned spaceship that has made it to and back from space. It's meant to transport not only supplies, but astronauts too. Number 8. First Unmanned Rocket Booster Landing Making the technology to have the ability to land a spacecraft was one of the main reasons Elon Musk originally established SpaceX. Realizing that on Mars, it was undoubtedly extremely costly to send humans there with the innovation of the time, Elon Musk set out to improve that technology to make it better and cheaper. One of the main upgrades required was the ability to reuse large parts of the spacecraft, which would otherwise melt in orbit. The initial step to making this a reality was landing an orbital first-stage rocket. SpaceX achieved this in 2015, breaking history as the first unmanned and standing land on Earth. Number 7. First Spacecraft Land on Water SpaceX landed their Falcon 9 rocket on a drone ship at sea after launching the vehicle into space. It's the first time the company has successfully been able to pull off an ocean landing after four past attempts finished in failure. This achievement is a critical milestone for SpaceX as it shows the company can land its rockets both on ground and in the water. Since SpaceX has proven it can do two types of landings, the company can potentially recoup and reuse significant more rockets in the future and that could mean a lot greater cost savings for SpaceX. Solidifying the ocean landing will be necessary since that's the kind of landing SpaceX will probably operate on more regularly. Ultimately, the company hopes to land 33% of its rockets on land and the rest at sea. Number 6. The First Tesla in Space Starman and his profound space ride have finished their first lap around the sun. The spacesuit-clad mannequin, who sits in the driver's seat of Elon Musk's red Tesla Roadster, was sent to space on February 6, 2018, on the first trip of the giant Falcon Heavy rocket. At launch, the Roadster's radio was playing David Bowie's Life on Mars. If the vehicle's battery is still functional, Starman has now heard the tune over 150,000 times. Also, the Tesla now has voyaged over 760 miles, that's 1.2 billion kilometers in space which means the vehicle has surpassed its 36,000-mile or 58,000-kilometer warranty about 21,000 times over. The first few trips by rockets are pretty unsafe, which proves why SpaceX decided to fake payload as opposed to an entire satellite on the Falcon Heavy launch. Musk has said he picked Starman as a roadster for entertainment mostly. However, the vehicle probably is a marketing in itself too. Number 5. Falcon Heavy Commercial Launch Sets a New Record 
Since Falcon Heavy's first trip to space, it has become a major part with commercial satellite takeoffs. The rocket can lift a great 141,000 pounds into space. That's a ton of Tesla Roadsters. One instance of a recent achievement of the Falcon Heavy mission last year was with the ArabSat 6A satellite, in which SpaceX beat its own record for distance covered during booster recuperation with a move that saw it re-emerge in Earth's atmosphere and travel around 770 miles. Number 4. SpaceX First Man Mission After SpaceX finished an in-flight abort trial of its Crew Dragon capsule, all systems and equipment were prepared for SpaceX's first astronaut takeoff. The notable flight occurred effortlessly, dispatching on May 30, 2020, and docking at the International Space Station a day later on May 31. Despite the fact that it was going great, the astronauts Bob Behnken and Doug Hurley said that riding a Falcon 9 was entirely different than riding NASA's space shuttle and that the experience was fairly more unpleasant than anticipated. After the space travelers had remained on board the ISS for a little more than two months, the recently named Endeavour Demo-2 container got back to Earth on August 2, 2020, with the astronauts on board. Number 3. SN5 Starship Prototype Success After Starhopper's second dry run saw the organization hop its model about 500 feet, hop means sending the aircraft up into the air without reaching orbit. Further tests, including a couple of less rewarding ones, led to the development and construction of a full Starship Model 1, the SN5, on August 5, 2020. SpaceX reached around 500 feet with a jump of its SN5 Starship model at its Boca Chica development facility. The SN5 Starship model utilized one Raptor engine for its experimental test. To put this into view, Elon Musk recently declared that the last design, including Super Heavy, will incorporate around 41 Raptor engines. And that's a whole lot of engine. Number 2. SpaceX 100th Launch and 6th Time Using Falcon 9 Booster With SpaceX's unbelievably crammed takeoff schedule, the accomplishments are coming in quick. Early in the year on August 18, 2020, SpaceX set two amazing achievements with one takeoff. SpaceX's 11th Starlink satellite launch was additionally the 100th dispatch in the organization's history. Likewise, the mission was additionally the sixth time the SpaceX reused the Falcon 9 booster. That's another record for the most time SpaceX or any organization has reused a commercial rocket. A genuine demonstration of SpaceX's dedication towards rocket reusability. And if they're able to lock this down, imagine how much money and time would be saved in between launches. And at number 1. Starhopper's First Untethered Flight Starhopper is SpaceX MK-1 model for Starship, the rocket that Musk expects will in the end take people to Mars. To test the enormous power of Starship's Raptor engines in flight, SpaceX has done hops with Starhopper. Starhopper's first jump sent it 65 feet or 20 meters into the air prior to returning to land. As Elon Musk put it on Twitter, water towers can fly. Well, that's going to be all for today. Humans on Mars may become real thanks to all the scientists and the works of Elon Musk. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for future uploads. And I'll see you next time.